Hey everybody, Mr. Movies87 here, welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Blue, brought to you by MuchGames.ca. Yeah, it's uh, been a little while since my last episode of this, uh, three weeks ago or so. I do apologize for that kind of abrupt hiatus there, but now we're back in action on Route 8 over here. Um, I said Route 7 last episode, I'm not sure why. Um, Route 7 is the area that's to the west of Celadon, and we're, well, kind of to the east of Celadon. So, there's that. Um, got fully healed up last episode. So now let's go ahead and take out some more trainers with Sparky. Still a handful of more around here. Uh, yeah, I, I stepped all these guys on my way through here before. Hey, dude. You need strategy to win at this. Mm, sometimes. Like in the newer games, you do. But in these older ones, just like spam your most powerful move and you're pretty much good to go. So, there you go. Oh, hey, a Grimer. Who's raising the roof, apparently. Not sure why, but there you go. But yeah, Sparky plus Thunderbolt equals, you know, dead most everything, really. Except, you know, ground and rock types because they resist resist thunder. Well, ground is immune to it, and rock, I think, resists it. But anyway, ooh, a muck. Who's... That's a very large hand you have there, Mr. Muck. Like, a very large hand. Also, Sparky, I am loving these crits right now. Please keep it up, if you would, please. Hey, level 28! Good job, Sparky, I love you. And one more. Ooh, another Grimer. Okay, now let's go ahead and... Mm, let's go back to, uh... Let's go over to Mew. I want to show off Psychic. If I haven't already. I don't think I did before. No, I'm pretty sure I haven't. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, pull out that. Yeah, Psychic, if you recall, yeah, I found that in Saffron City from uh, Mr. Psychic's house there. So yeah, that is pretty much Mew's standby attack for the remainder of the game. It's super, super powerful. Uh, I think 90 base power, and Mew being pure sighted gets full stab from that. So that's 45 more attack on top of that. So it's pretty ridiculous. And plus, yeah, that'll one-shot just about anything, really, for quite some time. I'm a rambling, gambling dude. Apparently so, you're also bald. So, ha, take that, I win. So what Pokemon do you have? Ooh, a Grolf. It's a, I call it a Grolf, I have no idea why. It's not actually that, but it's a, it's a Growlithe. Anyway, wouldn't mind using one of those at some point. Although I have before. They are pretty good. Especially its Evolution Arcanine. That thing is a beast. It's pretty much, well, what's called a pseudo-legendary. Its base stats, uh, base stat total, is uh, right below the level of a legendary Pokemon. I believe like 600 and higher. Um, this, well, most Pokemon have a, B a BST that high. But yeah, his total is like, um, I think 560 or whatever. Also, Vulpix, really. I was just saying how Mew can one-shot just about anything with Psychic, and then you go and survive with like one damn HP. I hate you. Well, not really, but you get the idea. Hey, level 29 from you. Awesome. One more level, he'll learn learn a new attack. Kind of weird, yeah, he learns one every 10 levels, but, uh, eh, well, I don't mind. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back to... Eh, we'll go with Cecil this time. And I think there's one more trainer around here? This should be her right here. Hello! Supposed to a Moonstone. Oh, wait, I already... I fought you before. When did I do that? Must have been a while ago. I don't even remember. Nah, oh well. No biggie. Okay, so we're done with that. Wait, why the hell am I walking? That's for, like, that's for Neanderthals. I can fly. Uh, let's go back to Celadon there. I'll get healed up, and then I will go tackle the gym. Shouldn't be that bad. My levels, I would like them to be a little bit higher than where they're at right now. But the gym, overall, isn't that hard. Um, so we should be okay. I mean, I have Fiero to spam fly anyway. Uh, Mew can use Psychic on any uh, poison types I fight. Oh yeah, the, the gym is um is grass type, by the way. If I didn't say so uh, in past episodes, I'm pretty sure I have. I don't remember. Again, it's been three weeks since my last episode, so yeah. Um, uh, oh, the gym's down. Well, I'm kind of close to it, but just going the wrong way. Oh yeah, one thing before going into the gym, you'll want to have a lot of status carrying items like antidotes, awakenings, and paralyzed heals. Um, that should be enough. 
if need be, I, I can always just retreat back to the Pokemon Center to heal, so I'm not overly concerned about that. Uh, but let's see. Oh, another cut tree. Oh, go down. Ding dust. There you go. Um, lawnmower, you have cuts. There we go. Yeah, unfortunately, Lawnmower is going to have to wait a while till evolving again. It'll be worth it, though. He'll be very, very powerful once he uh, does evolve. Alright, so let's see what's going on over here. Kind of really out of the way to get to this place. Oh, that's not creepy at all. Some old guy peeking in on them. Yeah, not weird at all. No, no, no. Let's see. Uh, Cecil, um... Yeah, let's see. He should be fine, I would say, for this area. Oh, for this gym, I should say. Um, yeah, yeah, I think so. I'm gonna try to avoid using Godzilla because, well, grass beats water, like, pretty badly. <laughs> so, yeah I'll, 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 yeah, I'll avoid that. Anyway, lots more trainers in here, too, so let's get to it. Um, but I need all the badges of Kanto, so I kinda have to be in here. I can't dress up as a girl and sneak in through here, that would just be crazy. That sounds familiar. <laughs> yeah, I know, they did that in the anime, I was being facetious. Anyway, Bellsprout! I had one of those. He grew up, though. And now he's a big ol' weepin' derp. Weepin' Bell is kinda derpy, if you think about it. As you'll soon see here from the front view. Yeah, a little bit of a, uh, of a derp. It's like, I, I know a couple of derps. I have two of them. They walk on four legs and are huskies. Also, that should not have paralyzed me. Just, uh... Oh, and I'm wrapped, too. Oh, boy! So much fun! Ah, I hate rap. I really do. Both the attack and the genre of music itself. Can, can you... Can you stop, please? That's four times now, I believe? Do I hear five? Really? Can, can I have a turn? Can, can I have a turn? No? Okay. I'll just sit back and watch as Cecil gets wrapped to death. Oh, my gravy. Can, can I have a turn? Can... Why is this still going on right now? I mean, this is funny and all, but I mean, it's, it gets old after a little while. Wow! I have never, ever seen this go on for this long before. And that's saying something. I have played this game how many times in my lifetime? Wow. <laughs> can I have a turn? Can, can I have a turn now? No? No? Okay. I... I got nothing. I have never seen this before. If I die to this... If I... If I die to this, I I might cry. Well, not really, but th this is still going. Wow. Maybe I should not have used Thrash. That might have been a bad move, although it doesn't really matter. Because, well, it, I, I didn't kill the thing in one shot anyway. I'm going to die to this, aren't I? And I can't switch. Oh my god, this is actually happening right now. <laughs> I cannot believe this. I mean, you can only laugh at this. I mean, come on now. I mean, there's no point in getting upset about it. I'm just laughing. But I I'm flabbergasted. I'm smetledorfed. Oh, hey, I actually didn't die. Wow. <laughs> Are you absolutely kidding me? I got my shit handed to me by a freaking weeping bell with rap and paralysis. I just wow. I it's over, so I'm happy about that, but I mean like still <laughs> that should not have happened. I'm pretty sure that went on for like a solid two minutes straight. Um I think so just about. That is just that's whack. That is just whack, yo. Also, it's 1990, so there you go. Oh yeah, were you watching that debacle of a Pokemon battle right there? I'd be bored too watching that shit. Anyway, oh hey, Oddish. I like Oddishes. 
I actually wish Pokemon Blue had them instead of Bellsprout, because I would I would definitely have used one of those. But, I mean, Onish and Bellsprout are both still good, of course. No. Now see, why is it that that time it didn't work? Said it was ineffective. The other time, it did work. I don't get that. I really don't. And that kind of bugs me, actually. Eh, whatever. It's Pokemon. I mean, come on now. Well, I need more Oddishes. Can I have one more Thrash? No. Okay, well, I'm gonna go and swap out. I do not want to deal with confusion, hats, and crap and whatnot. So I'll go with Tornado. Yeah, knowing my luck, for like five hits in a row, I'll hit myself for confusion damage or some crap. Uh, Pet should be strong enough here, I would hope. If not, nah. Oh, hey, there we go. Good job, Tornado. Oh, hey, a level. I can dig that. Yeah, unfortunately, no more new attacks for, uh, for Cecil there, but I don't really care. If you'd still kept him as Nidorino, he still would, would learn new stuff. But it'd be crap like, I think, Poison Stain and Double Kick, which... That isn't terrible, but the other moves are just not worth it at all. That's why I evolved them right back in Mount Moon when I did, so... Mainly for all the uh, extra stats there, and the, um... Well, it's overall better stats, really. And also the, um... You know, the better HP and also the better move set from TMs and all that. So there you go. Okay. Um, let's go in and battle you! This fight should go a lot easier and more smoothly than before. I still can't believe that happened. I cannot believe that. That was like... 20-some raps in a row? Well, not technically like the actual move in a row, but just... Just... Ugh. <laughs> oh, God. Well, we're past it now, so... Um... That's good. Anyway, and now, at this point, yeah, Tornado should pretty much one-shot most of these things. Um, Pet for right now will be more than plenty, I would think. But if need be, I can use Fly, because Fly is a lot more powerful than Pet. Yeah, I think Pet is like 40 base power, whereas Fly is, I think, 70. It was back then. Um, but yeah, I do like in the uh, later games, they actually upped its power to a 90, so it's a lot more viable to use. Um, no, that would be the old dude outside. Also, my name isn't, isn't Tom, by the way. Just say, just saying. Anyway, ooh, Bulbasaur. I like those. I should get back, get back to my uh, Bulbasaur only run I had going before. I will eventually, actually. I mentioned that on my other channel a while back. That I, uh, I will be reviving my old projects I had on my old channel there. Like, uh, that's uh, Cyndaquil, only, Cyndaquil only, only run. Um... Star Ocean 2, Wario Land, and Final Fantasy 9, and A Link to the Past. We'll be back eventually. Anyway, ooh, also an Ivysaur. I like that too. Yeah, Peck might not have been enough to one-shot it, so that's why I went with a uh, Fly there. I am hoping I can beat the gym today. I might just go for it anyway. Uh, we'll see how it goes. I take care of that. A few more trainers still yet to go. Um, lawnmower. I'm actually gonna keep you on the sidelines because all you really have is cuts, besides um, your other attacks there. So you will not be that useful at all. Sparky also won't be that good because grass resists electric in some cases. Um, so yeah, I'm not gonna worry about that. Um, I'll just stay with tornado actually. I'll worry about my levels later on. Because yeah, I, I will want to do some training here anyway. Um, pretty soon actually. Any buds or fire Pokemon in here? But what about flying or ice? Because they also beat grass. Yeah, grass is grass is vulnerable to a lot of attacks. They're still really good though. Um, I pretty much always have one in my team whenever I can. But even still, you, you, you can get by. Yeah, you can get by without one. So, also, not really sure why I used fly. Probably wasn't needed, but oh well. And let's see. Ooh, it's Loom. I, I, I like those. Yeah, the evolved form of Oddish there. I don't think we've seen one of these before. Not that I recall, anyway. But oh well, it's there. But yeah, again, good old Fly. Worked well enough. Um, I might go for some more length today, just so I can beat the entire gym. I don't want to cliffhang on right before Erica. 
So anyway, moving along to the next trainer here. Shouldn't you be, like, at the front of the gym, you know, to actually welcome people instead of being all the way back here? I don't know, that's just me. I need some water. Ah, I love water. I have no idea why these trainers have a whip. Seems a little violent to me. I don't know. Anyway, Weep and Derp, go ahead and just bam, fly all day. Yeah, the only bad part with Fly yet is a two-turn move there, so you pretty much could just use Pet twice, and that'll give you the same damage there, but nah, either's fine, really. Hey, more Gloom. Why are you drooling? Although I think, isn't that like in the anime the droll kind of, like, poisonous or something, I think? I don't remember. I haven't watched the actual show in so freaking long. But back in my day, pretty much all it was... Well, like Kanto and Johto and all that. Nowadays, yeah, they're into the uh, Etsin Y stuff. With, uh, what's the region even called in Etsin Y? Um, wow, I have no idea. Oh, Kalos, that's right. I knew that. <laughs> Though Etsin Y are really good games, by the way. I've played through them both a lot. And I pretty much always do a, a, a Wonder Trade file. And I'll just pick my starter from the get go. And then, um,. Just catch a bunch of other random Pokemon and just train them all the way until I get my team built up. It takes me quite a while to do, because I want to try to get some really good Pokemon. Ones that are, well, powerful as is, but also on a low level. So yeah, it didn't take me quite a while until I did a file going for that, but oh well. If I had the means to do so, I would gladly LP both of them on either this channel or my, my current one. But maybe in the future I can get to the, around to that. But, oh, well, not a big deal. Oh, by the way, yeah, executes. Ah, excuse me. Wow, sorry about that. Yeah, it's... it's... yeah, not a big deal. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save here for right now, and... Yeah, you know what? I'll go ahead and fight Erica right now. I should be able to handle her. Um, lovely weather. Not really, actually. At least for me right now, it's still really kind of cloudy and gray out. And not... it's warm-ish, but... nah. Oh, hi, this is Erica. Erica! I don't know where that came from. No, I thought they were water type! Could have fooled me. Did you not just see me manhandling all of your trainers? I shouldn't say that. Whoops. All female gym. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> I, um, defeated all of your trainers, so you should have guessed. Anyway, Erica. Ooh, victory bell. I almost have one of you. I will soon enough, though. Well, maybe in like eight levels or so. I gotta wait a while. <laughs> because, yeah, I want Weeping Bell to learn Razor Leaf first, because Razor Leaf is really, really good. Well, not. Well, it's it works well enough. Oh, there's something. Oh, wait, oh, wait, 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 wait. What the hell? Oh, yeah, there we go. Never mind that. That's just me fumbling around like a, like a buffoon. Oh, level 31. Nice. Anyway, who do we have next? Ooh, a Tangela. Tangela itself, um, you know, it's a pure grass type. Unfortunately, not really that good. The evolution, though, Tang Growth, is extremely good. Um, it has some, uh, I think, four of his base stats, a uh, hundred plus. I believe, um, you know, HP, attack, special attack, and I believe defense as well are all a hundred plus base. But the speed and special defense are really, really low, if I recall. But still, it's really damn powerful, and I highly recommend using one. Um, I believe it was available 4th gen onward, if I recall. So there's that. And ooh, a Vile Plume, her last Pokemon here. Uh, the final evolution of Oddish and Gloom there. Again, still uh, Grass Poison, also, you know, that's kind of... Okay. I'm not sh Why did Fly miss? How dare you? Well, this is why I'm using Tornado, because he resists Grass-type moves. Also, Petal Dance there is essentially the grass version of Thrash there. So thankfully for- WHY IS FLY MISSING?! <sighs> Twice in a row. Oh well. Fly, do not miss again, or I will do something. Okay, then I'll just miss, there we go. Okay, crit, please, please. Okay, that works too. Well, not quite, but I'll take it anyway. <laughs> oh well. 
change. I'll, I'll go for a pet. I don't want to have wait. I don't, don't want to waste a turn with fly there. And of course, now I did a crit because why not? Ah, <sighs> well there you go. There's Erica. Hooray! That was weird. I wanted to say yay and Ray came out. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. Whatever. Yay! And here we get the rainbow badge. Woohoo! Up to level 50, you obey. Awesome. Also allows Pokemon to use strength in and out of battle. Um, I do have that. Actually, do I have that? I don't even remember. <laughs> wow, I'm stupid. Oh no, I'm forgetful, really. Oh yeah, well, there's Meta Drain here. Like, I want to see if I have strength. I forget if I do or not. Um, okay, not yet. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and call it quits here. Um, I'll heal up off camera, and then we'll head off to... Well, somewhere. Next time on Let's Play Pokemon Blue. This has been Mr. Movies 87 signing off, guys. Have a great day, and thanks for watching.